Hello, this here is Mike McLean from Nerdy Reviews, and today we're going to be reviewing Smokey and the Bandit. So Smokey and the Bandit was released in 1977, and it starred Burt Reynolds, Sally Field, Jackie Gleason, Jerry Reed, and Mike Henry. And the story of Smokey and the Bandit goes, Little and Big Ines Burnett, uh, which are wealthy Texans, hire the Bandit, which is played by Burt Reynolds, and Snowman, which is played by Jerry Reed, to go to Texarkana, Texas, to carry uh, 400 cases of cores to Atlanta, Georgia. Uh, but their challenge is to do it in 28 hours or less. Things are going great until a runaway bride, played by Sally Field, uh, enters into the story. Uh, thus began the chase between the Bandit and Sheriff Buford D. Justice. Um, overall, I like the presentation of the movie. Um, it came out uh, before the Dukes of Hazzard, which kind of sets the pace for movies like that. Uh, and the casting was really great. Burton Reynolds was kind of made for this role. and The music was uh, pretty great, uh, especially with the original score uh, and the original songs done by uh, the snowman himself, Mr. Jerry Reed. But two variants were made of this song. Uh, one was called Westbound and Down. And the other one, uh, which is the one he released on an album, Eastbound and Down. Uh, some of the things that I find wrong is a there's CB talk that some audience members may not understand. Also, the humor coming from Mike Henry uh, as a uh, junior wasn't falling through, but I do have to say it's kind of making up for Mike Henry kind of keeping up with Jackie Gleason's uh, Buford T. Justice humor. But the but the two do complement themselves uh, very well, so I do have to give credit to the writers for that one, uh, as well as the actors. All right, uh, so let's give this movie a score. So this has been uh, Mike McLean from Nerdy Reviews. That's it for me this week. Have yourselves a good week.